Atar focused this Sunday morning the National Investigation Agency probe against separatists in the valley kick-started by India Today's sting operation has started to hit them where it hurts. The NIA will continue to grill the stung Hurriyat leaders for a second consecutive day in Srinagar today. The questioning will focus largely on the funding from Pakistan, which India today exposed in its sting operation. Teams of the NIA will fan out to different areas of Kashmir for further probe. Remember, the National Investigation Agency on Saturday had interrogated the three separatist leaders, Naim Khan, Farooq Ahmed Dar, and Ghazi Javed Baba. Bitta Karate was grilled for over two hours while questioning of the other two separatists continued till late in the night. This probe comes after India today exposed the nexus between terror groups in Pakistan with the Hurriyat leaders. A strong investigation also laid bare how funds are being pumped in from Pakistan to keep the valley on the boil. For more on this, I am joined by India Today uh, correspondent Kamalji Sandhu, who has been giving us minute-by-minute -minute updates on that big story and has been in Srinagar and uh, covering this uh, story for us. A very good morning, Kamalji Sandhu. Uh, can you please give us more details about this NI investigation? Uh, where is it headed now? Well, this is day two of the NI investigation. There has been a sustained in, uh, interrogation of the accused, especially of Naeem Khan. What is important is uh, that they were questioned regarding the past money trail. Uh, we've also been told by our sources that today the sustained interrogation is going to continue. Uh, they've been asked to get certain bank accounts, details, uh, some more documents. Uh, remember, uh, the NI, meanwhile, has also collected the FIRs of at least 150 copies have been uh, brought to uh, Srinagar. Uh, some of this is of obviously burning down schools, the police station, of other government buildings uh, during the eight-month turmoil period. So obviously they'll have to prove their innocence, but at this point of time, uh, the focus is going to be not just on the money trade, but also on the revelations made in the India Today thing. All right. Uh, thank you so much, Kamaljeet, uh, for that update. We will keep coming back to you for more on the story. Well, India Today's uh, fearless reporters have nailed the separatists and in return, India Today's crew was targeted and assaulted for posing tough questions to separatists Yasin Malik and Naeem Khan. You will see their actions on your screens as they dodge direct questions by the India Today crew, instead accusing us of airing doctored videos. They act tough when it comes to inciting violence and fueling the fire of unrest in the valley. But when it comes to answering questions, we see their cowardice on screen, trying to evade questions. On Friday, when India Today's Kamaljeet Sandhu cornered JKLF chief Yasin Malik over the Hurriyat truth tapes expose, his response was astonishing. Malik first invited our crew into his residence and then assaulted them. He broke equipment and even physically assaulted the video journalist. But he got so agitated, he came out, he snatched my phone saying, I'm doing a sting. He took away my phone. He broke it. Uh, he assaulted my uh, camera person. Then, he brazenly accused our crew of barging into his house and justified his actions. We told him we'll wait outside. He asked me why you are here. I told him we've been trying to call him since morning. There was no response. Stung by our investigation, Hurriyat leader Naeem Khan vanished into thin air, emerging after five days. Claiming the Hurriyat tapes are doctored, even as his boss Gilani doesn't agree, suspending him. Voice up the moment up my mouth up the Kabi Kisi Kabi Kime jacket me lagayahu, Kabi me waistcoat me ho, Kabi me thunder kabade me ho. कभी तीन साल पुराना कोई वीडियो वो मिक्स करके मेरी वॉइस को मिक्स करके आउट ऑफ कंटेक्स्ट पेश किया गया है अ विजिबली रफल्ड नेम कान अवॉइडेड ऑल आवर क्वेश्चंस इंडिया टुडे स्टिंग हैज शेकन अप इंडिया बट कैन सस्पेंडिंग नेम बी इनफ द बॉल इज नाउ क्लियरली इन द गवर्नमेंट्स कोर्ट इज इट टाइम टू जेल हुरियत हॉक्स 
with Kamaljeet Sandhu, Ashutosh Mishra and Anindya Banerjee in Srinagar. Bureau Report, India Today. Six days on since India Today released the Huryad Truth Tapes, let's take a look at what the exposed separatists have dealt with and how the hard-hitting special investigation by a group has shaken up their lives. India Today's agenda-setting expose has stung the valley's villains. Unmasking the Park Huryat cash connection. Pakistan, sir, you are in which touch? No, there are also people in Pakistan. As our sting ripped apart the devious designs of the anti-India forces in Kashmir, the Hurriyat leaders have tried every tactic, dodging questions, assaulting our crew and running away in fear. Stung Hurriyat leader Naim Khan resorted to threats after his wife Hamida stormed out of India Today's debate. You have you, you shown my wife on TV. This is again journalist ethics. Whatever rubbish I know, since you are playing on your TV channel. I am not available for your TV channel. What is rubbish and nonsense? What you are saying on camera that you are burning schools in Kashmir? When you are on camera saying you are burning schools in Kashmir? When you are on camera saying you are taking money from Pakistan to spread unrest in Kashmir? Kashmir is not teaching the professor and you are refusing on the basis of the police you are possibly getting. The police you are, uh, I don't know who is threatening you. But India today continued its relentless pursuit of the truth. As we reached Naim Khan's door in Kashmir, his wife admitted on camera that Park funding Buryat is an open secret. She chased away our crew. Five days after India Today's special investigation, the rattled hawks get desperate, even resorting to violence. It's a jittery reaction coming in from JKLF leader Yasin Malik. When we post questions to him, he made false accusations. Uh, this is the job of a journalist. We go and post some tough questions, whether it's the government or whether it's the Hurriyat. It is not just about the ideology. It's about answering some tough questions, whether it is related about money trail from Pakistan or whether it is about condemning an incident, something which he's still not done. If assaulting India today journalists wasn't enough, JKLF chief Yasin Malik went on to brazenly accuse our crew of barging into his bedroom. A reporter who you have told me that a reporter who has been Kamal Jit, who has been in the bedroom. Because I have heard his version that he has been on the phone. A woman who has been in the bedroom is not in the bedroom. अलग न सलग सीधे सवालात लेकर खड़ी हो जाती है मैंने उससे कहा मुझे कोई बात नहीं करनी है ये वहाँ से सवालात दोबारा शुरू फैटेंड ऑन पार्क कैश एंड नाउ देयर डर्टी ट्रूथ ऑन मास्ट द हॉक्स आर फ्लीइंग ट्राइंग टू इंटिमिडेट अस you are saying you take fund from Pakistan. You are saying it is indigenous movement. If you are taking fund from Pakistan, how it is indigenous movement? This is indigenous. You are not. You are cheaters. You are. You are. You take fund from Pakistan. How it is indigenous movement, sir? Who are you? I am not answerable to you. Who are you? I am not here to answer. I am not answerable to this. In March, we exposed Kashmir's deadliest stone pelters, admitting on camera that they got park funds to hold the valley to ransom. This week's Hurriyat Truth tapes are a slap in the face of separatists who claim to be the valley's messiahs. Our relentless campaign to unmask the valley's villains continues. Suspensions, 
warnings and lies are not the answers that will bring our search for the truth to an end. We ask direct questions and won't stop till we get clear answers. With Kamaljeet Sandhu, Ashutosh Mishra and Anindyo Banerjee in Srinagar, Bureau Report, India Today.